The future, year 2050. With all the technological advancements that are being achieved today, the years to come are going to be some of the most interesting yet. Today, we'll be looking at some of the mind-blowing technology predictions that we might see in the year 2050. Number one, robots will have a mind of their own. Historically, robots have changed the operation of different industries on a huge scale. With the current global pandemic, the demand for robotics has largely increased due to the prevention of human interactions. Experts say that it is feasible for robots and machines to gain consciousness, like humans, with the power of machine learning and artificial intelligence. If you are satisfied with Alexa or Siri as assistants that respond to whatever question or command you may have, there really wouldn't be a difference with you having a human-like robot that has a mind of its own by your side. In 2016, Sophia, one of the most advanced humanoid robots ever created, rocketed to stardom. Sophia is a social robot created by the former Disney Imagineer David Hansen, and she was built to mimic social behaviours and inspire feelings of love and compassion in humans. Sophia is made from a flexible rubber skin that makes her look more human and convey human-like expressions. She is definitely still a work in progress as she uses artificial intelligence to formulate her responses from pre-written speeches. No robots have yet achieved artificial general intelligence that would make them versatile and human-like smart, but we can expect a future where we live in a world with conscious human-like robots. Number two, nanobots will plug our brains. By 2050, we might have nanobots that can extract data from our brain. By this time, nanobots will also be able to place the knowledge from our brains directly into cloud storage giving them a virtual reality of complete immersion within our nervous system. With nanobots extending our brain to the storage-based clouds, we will be able to extract the memories of our loved ones and even create a virtual version of them. In the future, our brains will be able to perform just like smartphones because we will be able to expand our nanocortex to the cloud. This advancement in neuroscience would help in memory problems, validation of evidence and so on. With the idea of nanobots plugging into our brains, reincarnation through AI is also an idea that is set for the future. Augmenting nanobots with a DNA sampling of a deceased loved one will make this idea a possibility. Number three, space tourism. Space tourism is expected to be present for the foreseeable future. This is most likely possible with rocket companies like Jeff Bezos's Blue Origin and Elon Musk's SpaceX trying to make this vision possible. SpaceX has already taken the lead in the development of sustainable space tourism, allowing Musk's dream to bring humans to Mars. But this will cost a lot of money to actualize such a dream, and if one of these companies is ever to succeed in making space tourism possible, it will cost a whopping amount of money that would be hard to afford by the average person today. Number five augmented and virtual reality. With the reduction of human physical interaction to prevent the spread of coronavirus, most education systems and workforces were forced to adapt a virtual style. The current pandemic has shown us how technology helps us in maintaining and facilitating communication for our work, business, school, and even our personal loved ones. We've seen the rise of VR in gaming applications and mapping software, and in the next couple of years, it is expected to see many more advancements with artificial intelligences to build and connect people at a human level. Virtual and augmented reality will be the next big thing to make people feel closer, even when they are physically apart. There will be a better system with maps using VR to present a more realistic surrounding in order to boost user experience. Number six, wearable technologies. At present, technology has turned many gadgets into something that we can wear. Take music for example. Before, you could only play music through your MP3 players and speakers. Now, you can play music through things like your smartwatches and tablets. Smartwatches can even do things like monitor your heart rate and send messages. In the year 2050, there will be more advancements in wearable technology, like a wearable coronary heart monitoring t-shirt where it calculates heart pulses and synchronizes them to the cloud over the internet. This will further help the monitoring of patients with heart conditions to calculate data 
and distinguish sporadic pulses that can help prevent the occurrence of cardiac arrest. Number seven, drone delivery and automated aerial vehicles. Cars and other land vehicles will not just be the only ones that will operate themselves. The future innovations will also let aerial vehicles be piloted autonomously or remotely. This will change not only the face of military operations, but also for rescue missions, firefighting, law enforcement and agriculture. The Association for Unmanned Vehicle System International, the trade group that represents manufacturers and users of drones and other robotic equipment, predicts that 80% of the marketplace will eventually be used for agricultural uses. Farmers can use drones to monitor their crops as well as to precisely maximise their use of pesticides and fertilisers. Companies like Amazon are hiring drones for the delivery of products and groceries, but futurists say that these systems might be suitable for only small packages and might not go widespread in the future. Nonetheless, the possibilities for these drones are practically endless. There is no question that drones will be staying with us for quite a long time. Number eight electric vehicles and Hyperloop. Many of us are tired of long drives and long commutes. Electric self-driving cars would change the way of transportation. By 2050, we will most probably have vehicles with full autonomy, meaning self-driving cars with no windscreen and steering wheels. But Elon Musk has plans to take transportation to a higher level. He wants to achieve transportation that will reduce transit-related greenhouse gas emissions by 90% through Hyperloop. This ambitious goal of Musk is to develop the future of rail travel using pods in a vacuum tube that allows you to seamlessly travel at 760 miles per hour. The basic idea of how Hyperloop works is just like how a train works, but drastically reduces friction. The tunnels in which it operates must have most of their air removed. They are not complete vacuums, but much lesser air means reduced friction and much less energy is required. A handful of passengers will be contained in a pod and will go through the vacuum tubes. All this will be battery and solar powered, so no need to worry about the increase in carbon footprints. Hyperloop is just how Musk puts it, the fifth mode of transport. It is designed to link Los Angeles to San Francisco. This will greatly help the future of transportation. Number nine, Wi-Fi charging. Chargers have become more efficient in today's time, from wireless chargers to all-in-one magnetic chargers. Charging has also become technologically advanced. Apple just released their latest version of iPhone 12, where chargers are not included in the box and should be brought separately to reduce waste. But in the future, we can truly realise the reduction of our waste with Wi-Fi chargers. Forget about the wireless chargers and the battery packs, you won't be needing them in the future. A team from the University of Washington has developed a power over Wi-Fi system, where you can recharge batteries through the air from up to 28 feet away. The developers are currently working on improving the system and are researching whether it fits better for commercial or industrial use. Number 10, seamless IoT in home and business. Have you heard about IoT or the internet of things? If not, imagine a world where everything in our physical world is seamlessly and securely connected. The spread of IoT has a huge impact in our daily life and its spread is expected to continue in the next decades to come. It is predicted that by 2050, there will be 24 billion interconnected devices which means everything around us, the streetlights, fitness trackers, cars, elevators, will all be connected. These IoT-enabled devices contain sensors that constantly collect and react to data. With IoT progressively becoming an important aspect of our life, we expect to see more smart cities, smart homes, smart industries, and energy-saving lifestyle in the next decades to come. Number 11, bioprinting. Aside from the industrial aspects, health and medicine will also face drastic advancements in the year 2050. 3D printing is increasingly permitting the direct digital manufacture of a wide variety of plastics and metal items. This has triggered a manufacturing revolution and has also triggered the development of bioprinting. Bioprinting is the process of creating cellular structures using 3D printing techniques, 
where cell functions remain even after the printing process. This idea had been developed when a professor realised that the droplets of ink in a standard inkjet printer are about the same size as human cells. In 2010, the first blood vessels to be bioprinted using cells that were cultured from a single person were successfully created. Other researchers are experimenting on the possibilities of bioprinting an organ and regenerating scaffolds and bones. Such developments could therefore spark a medical revolution that will further develop techniques that will enable cells to be printed directly into the human body. The potential to use bioprinters to repair wounds and regenerate parts of our body is just mind-blowing. In the next decades, it may be possible to regenerate not just a cell or a blood vessel, but also an injured organ directly inside of our body. We are living toward a world where things are going digital and where there are constant changes. The year 2050 seems to be a long way off, but we are succeeding in predicting the future and its technological advancements. We look forward to a world where technology will make our life easier than ever before. What other things do you think we might see by the year 2050? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this one. Thanks for watching.